Who better than someone using a technology to talk about it? On the IoT show today, we have Raja from our partner TCS, who will tell us all about how they're using Azure IoT to bring value to their customers. Hi everyone, thanks for watching the IoT Show. I'm Olivier, your host, and we have Raja from TCS, one of our lead partners with us today to talk about TCS and the value they're adding to our customers in our partnerships. Raja, thanks for joining the IoT Show today. It's my pleasure, Olivier. So for our audience, can you tell us a bit about yourself and about TCS, uh, sure. Tata Consultancy Services? Sure, I'm Raja Shanmugam, and I'm responsible for globally for IoT business development. Uh, from TCS IoT unit, okay, and uh, we focus on IoT and digital twin solutions across awesome. industries to deliver the business outcome way focused solutions mm -hmm. for our customers. Okay, and whether it is manufacturing or retail or transportation or high tech or telecom industry, as well as on mm -hmm. energy utilities, I think across the industries. I think we have been successful along with us okay. to drive this transformation for our customers. Interesting. So Microsoft is a is a partners company. We work with partners. We build platforms. I think IoT is one of these um, technologies that we actually rely even more on our partners because there's an expertise that is required to get to production. Correct. That actually is is something that you don't invent yourself an expert in IoT solutions uh, overnight. And we need to have we platform providers. We need to have partners like you guys to integrate solutions for customers, right? Correct, correct, very true. And uh, because it is not just the technology alone, it is technology and knowing the customer's business problem. And third is like, it is not only the problem, what are the aspirations of the customers? Mm -hmm. And if you look at it, most often customers have the vision already laid out, saying that I want to improve the operational excellence, or I want to change the business model, I want to improve the services revenue. Mm -hmm. I think it is well laid out in the boardroom discussions, what they if want. You look at what, they what they want, want. Yeah. but there is a gap between what they want versus the value actually realized on the okay. ground. Okay. So, so that is a gap and it is to fill the gap, it, that is where I think Azure, I mean Microsoft and TZ mm -hmm. is where we come yeah. together in making the vision to value realized on the ground. But wh why do you think customers are having issues getting to that value? Is it because it's hard? Is it because the technologies that they, they want to use and implement in their existing solutions is hard to implement and integrate? W what is it that you think makes these customers not getting that value? Uh, actually, I would say that that is, uh, I think when IoT buzz was happening like mm -hmm. last three years, I think people were more looking at an exploratory way initially. So just ad hoc, uh, use case development or one point solution is never is going to transform the entire organization. Like it will only give you a proof of technology. But okay. if you really need to achieve the value, it comes through scale. Mm -hmm. And the scale needs to be thought through up front. Like what is the business case behind it? Which, what I'm going to impact? Yeah, yeah. Based on which, what I'm going to derive out of it. So that is the uh, need we also felt in the market. That is where we launched the IoT business framework called bringing life to things. Okay. That is like, it is not just taking the data from the devices, but actually, how do you make the devices itself to aware what it is doing as well as enable it to control themselves. Like so that. we call it like connect mm -hmm. in context first, mm -hmm. move to a predictive stage, mm -hmm. and move to a self-aware stage. And this is not just for one function. Mm -hmm. It can be for the production, it can be for the supply chain, it can be for the customer service. And how you bring newer business capabilities within the organization, for that, what use cases mm -hmm. and what business outcome can be derived. So okay. I think we have created this map for multiple industries. Yeah. So this is the path to value roadmap that we are taking to our customers so that they can realize the value, not just doing one of use cases, right? Makes sense, makes sense. So um, I, wanted, I wondered actually how the Azure IT technologies are helping you doing that. Because c customers, they have an objective, they have an existing technology. We provide a platform for them to get there. Uh, but how, like, why not creating your own set of platforms on, on an infrastructure uh, as a service platform or something like that, rather than like jumping onto Azure IoT? What is the value? How, how do you think Azure IoT fits the need of the customers and help, you, you know, help them deliver that? Uh, I always say that, see, when you are thinking about, I think business value really comes through scale, and mm -hmm. scale comes with multiple challenges. Yeah. And uh, I think Azure and uh, your engineering team is continuously inventing on the newer services. And mm -hmm. I think you are going to launch 
from a security perspective as your spear is coming up in february yeah. Yeah. and if you look at iot hub and it's fantastic and mm -hmm. we have leveraged it for one of the customers to connect 200000 devices yeah. into the so such a scale mm -hmm. and i think when somebody is investing and you just better leverage it so that you are able to make it happen yeah. and i also uh, ask our customers to focus on what do they want not on the technology because technology is already yeah. given i think they should take that point yeah <laughs> so basically we're delivering the platform you're delivering a solution to the customers for them to just use it yeah now That's for them hearing. so yeah. they should i want customers to ask for more so that yeah. it comes through the technology as well as the solutions that and the sense. knowledge to the customers yeah. <laughs> are there specific verticals that tcs specializes in and can you give us a couple of example of actual customers that you've been working with to deliver this kind of like scalable solutions yeah Uh, I will take one of the well. In, uh, it was a very well-known video mm -hmm. in the social media, which is by Daman, one of our customers in mm -hmm. Netherlands. Okay. And if you look at Daman as a maritime shipbuilding manufacturer, but their strategy is to not just manufacturing of the ships, but they mm -hmm. want to be as integrator in the maritime industry. Okay. What does it mean? Is they want to offer newer digital services to their end customers. Okay. Which is about how do we ensure that reliability of the ships how do you ensure the uptime of the ship mm -hmm. and also move instead of one time sale of a ships into a ser as a service model in the future okay. so this kind of a transformation with tcs and with us together we are delivering it awesome. and there were uh, cios as well as see was everybody is talking mm -hmm. how it has enabled their transformation through connected shipping platform powered by tcs Interesting technologies. So I think not only that, there are many other use cases yeah. I can go on and on because it is true and customers who are mm -hmm. embracing it with that uh, belief is able to really transform themselves and they are also yeah. more open. come to the market and say that how they yeah. are transforming so that others can get the belief and drive it forward it's great to hear that from uh, someone else uh, than microsoft people that <laughs> actually we we are selling that vision to our customers but it's great to see that people actually using our technologies to implement solutions for final customers yeah. or actually feeling the same way yeah. uh, <laughs> true uh, that's uh, a big it's feel good Thanks Roger for coming on the IoT show today, sharing your insights and your perspective on on IoT in general and how Azure IoT is helping you guys. Thanks guys for watching the IoT show. If you want to learn more about TCS, you can go to IoT show or actually aka.ms/iotshow/tcs and you'll get lots of information, case studies, uh, examples of realization and solutions that TCS built with customers. Thanks again Roger. Hope to see you soon. Thanks Olivier. Thanks Bye, guys. Thanks for watching.